Hi. Have you ever needed to blur an object, something or someone from your scene? With my friend here, I'm going to show you how. Let's open up DaVinci Resolve. Okay, we are in DaVinci Resolve and I've just um, put the clip that we just shot onto the timeline. And now, so I'm just going to go over here and I want to um, blur this cat's face. Okay, so let's play this a little bit and find Hi. where the beginning of this clip where we see the cat's face. Okay, so. Um, there we see the face okay so I will cut that here well, almost <laughs> right at the beginning of the clip anyway so um, and see where it stopped oh the whole thing okay so looks like we're gonna be uh, putting a mass over the, the whole thing pretty much so let's head over to the color tab um so let's uh first create a note note and just use a corrector note here and this note is highlighted i will use the circle uh, instead of a square because the cat's face is a circle so make sure you know if you don't see uh, the circle make sure you use this window okay it's a transform window so click that you could select square you know you could draw different uh, shapes so but I use the uh, circle because the cat's face is pretty much a circle so it's pretty easy to, to just use this and I just use red to feather that a little bit and basically I think I'm gonna start uh, okay from here okay so I'll click on the tracker window and because I, I know this whole thing doesn't move all the way to the back so I'm gonna track it uh, backwards at the beginning where the scene is moving so uh, I have my playhead here and I'm I, I'm high the tracker is highlighted I'll click track reverse and now can you see DaVinci Resolve is doing its magic okay now uh, this same method you could apply to removing or uh, to to blur anything you want okay so now this is done so now I head over to the blur window okay blur window and I'm just gonna move it so I could see the cat's face now watch this I just bring these bars up can you see the cat's face being blur right so you could select the degree of uh, how much blur you want so what I want to do is to kind of blur it kind of all the way so to one you could still go even more crazy with that if you want okay so it's really up to you okay so once that is done i'll head back to the edit tab and let's play that from the beginning and see what happened hi have you ever needed to blur an object something or someone from your scene see there you go now this cat is being blurred even from the beginning when we are moving because we apply the the tracker so uh, the venture is the DaVinci Resolve is tracking where the cat's head is, face is, and then applying the blur to the face, okay? That's it. It's just so simple to do. I hope you have learned something from this, and now you could go and create your masterpiece. So, have fun creating. <laughs>